And welcome back to Let's Play Dragon Age Origins. Shut up, you midget. Be quiet. You have no free will. Say hi, Pico. Hey, everybody, it's Zap Blast 9000. No, it's Pico. This is Pico Pod TAS. Is this my first time on your channel? Once you were uh, in the story, no, you were in the wrong te Tetris. See? You're in the Tetris video. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. That got uploaded. <laughs> from the same pen. Yes, it did. Oh, Not no, the Pong one. Though. Song. Oh, okay. Dormant my ass. You weren't even in that. Dormant my ass. <laughs> I won't disappear. I have, I have never seen a scrap of footage of this game before. <laughs> oh, this great Pika. This is one of my favorite games. <clears throat> it's another Bioware. Hey. I got a Canada. Damn, stranger. You're looking for a stool to share a brew? <laughs> you Sounds can thank me for Bioware. <laughs> name's Naveen. I fight with Your Prince Balin's expeditionary Pico. field unit. Apparently, Bioware is uh, one of the Big nicest places to, to work in Canada, Canada from what I've heard. I was in the deep roads when that one. Oh, yeah, they're a great by, game developing company. Mm -hmm. I mean, they probably even have a couch in their lounge and everything. <laughs> His I'm name was Duncan. Sure. Good man. Duncan so, McLeod. He knows what we go through in the deep roads. Not many do. Not even the ones who live this close. Rock and mustache and beard there. He is, dude. If you're a dwarf, you totally got a rock and mustache and beard. He's got a big nose, too. That's racist, Pico. Oh, I didn't know big nose jokes were insensitive to dwarves. Sorry. And, yeah, if you ever told that to Wario, he'd kick your ass. That's where they say. I kick your ass, amigo. Man, he does look like a Wario nose, doesn't it? Why is his beard braided? Getting more crowded these days. Lots of people I tend to not talk over when they when they actually speak. Sorry. Just because this game is big on character development and storytelling. us in at first bell. He's splitting us into four teams to search for some of the lost tigers. Looking for the tigers. Bronca, I guess. Bronca. Yeah. Who everyone's after? Bronca. She's the paragon we gotta find eventually. I'll pretend I know what a paragon like is. But she went batty and let her old house into the deep roads more than two years ago. Someone who's she an amazing inventor. A lot of good men are gonna die looking for her corpse. Excuse me. <laughs> that noble death mission. Taste awful bitter. Awful bitter. I will. It's like I will honorably die looking for a corpse. <laughs> Let, let, let's, let's, let's get drunk, Pico. Let, 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 52 types of ale, 17 types of meat, and a dozen imported wine. I uh, recommend a great she has a heavy 17 head types of meat, taste. good selection. Three silvers gives you a pint. Soul to the highest bidder. A breaky and brew never fails to hit the spot. What is wrong with your face? D stop making fun of the little people, Pico. They'll Hamlet. call you racist. A good man. Puts Orzammar's needs above his own. Well, I have other customers to see too. If you need anything else, just call me. I don't see any at the table. Bitch, don't lie to me. <laughs> I'll take my services elsewhere. I see how <laughs> empty it is in here. You don't have any other customers. <laughs> oh god, dwarven crap. Fine, dwarven crap. Here in Orzammar. Oh, well, we can talk to that bitch, but we're not gonna do that. Oh, you'll love my companions if you can see that. Good day coming. to you. Fuck you too. <laughs> My companion Bunny. was a maker. He has abandoned his creation. Hey, you two, shut up. Yeah, Blaine, why did you abandon you two? <laughs> hmm? She was saying you, they abandoned their creation. Like, nah, whatever. I've got Pokemon on the mind. How dare you reference that? I don't want to think about Pokemon. I'm never doing another Pokemon. <laughs> open. Swear to God. Dude, you gotta do Fire Red Moemon Omega Toho. Shut up. You better be don't you want to do Black and White Omega? <laughs> Let me tell you, I want to play the Pokemon in the room. Dude, you gotta do Good Hey You Pikachu. Oh, Welcome to the Listen, it's arena. Paul Edding. We're still Oof. closed until the fighters make their preparations. Colonel, Metal Gear, the Grand Palm Bit in. Oh, okay. So Enjoy our grand city. You hear it? I don't know the I don't know the Metal Gear voice actors. I, I don't play a lot of game with games with voice acting. <laughs> you insult your ancestors, Pico. Leighton and Sonic Colors is about as much voice acting as I get. Can you believe That's me? no good. Oh yeah, and the crappy voice acting in Elibits. And that's no good. 
We're gonna explore Orzammar, and I got Puiko here because he likes to sing too and make racist obscene humor because he's a Canadian. And apparently Canadians are racists. They are. Well, yeah. there's no black people in Canada, so... What? It, <laughs> I don't know, that's just a joke I heard somewhere, and it's kind of true, there's not a ton of black people. <laughs> it's all Asians in British Columbia. Yeah, I heard there's a lot of Asians. Yeah, it's Canadians. <laughs> Canadians. They're everywhere. Them damn Asians, they took my leg in the war. So oh, what does this, how does this place look to you, Pico? Um, looks like Soliana, just a bit. <laughs> nah, I'm kidding. Full of stones. I bet that reference flew over your head, didn't it? Possibly. I got money, Pico. Too many people talking, shut up! <laughs> you better spend it. <laughs> Hell no. I'm a Jew with my money in this game. What are you talking about? I don't do that. <laughs> For good reasons, though, Pico. In Awakening, which is the expansion, there's something that costs 80 sovereigns, which is 80 gold. I've only got 67 right now. Time played 15 hours. Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I told you this isn't a short game, Pico. Yeah. Actually, this is pretty good timing for me, playing through this game, mm. considering how much I've done. He's got a hope the green gas cloud behind him, he's constantly farting. A sword is enchanted with poison. Oh, okay. And, and uh, runes that I put in it. Shale, my golem is speaking. He's got a cool helmet. What? Who, me? Yeah. Yeah, this is a uh, DLC. I got it from doing the King's mission, which, well, the King dies, but spoilers. Even though you never seen this dun, dun. game. Oh, great. Uh, now I have no reason to ever play it. Thanks. Oh, <laughs> now I, I, what? I, that happens like at the beginning <laughs> of the game. I wasn't going to play it anyway. <laughs> oh, you are. You, I know you have uh, You have a PC, a PS3, and a... I, I don't have a PS3 anymore. God oh, damn it, Pico. This has dragged on too long. Your brother has a 360. Use that. He's, we're going to be mailing it to him because he's uh, elsewhere right now. He's at an internship somewhere. Racism. And why was that codex all the way on top of the building? I don't know. <laughs> they need their exercise every morning, I guess. The public doesn't need to know shit. Just like the real world. She wants a job here in Orzmar underground, was surrounded by dwarves. Oh my fucking god, so many voices! Shut up! Get the voices out of my head! I'm not crazy! Oh great, it crashed. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh no, my game's still working. What are you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> Let's talk to Order. this guy. It is always a blessing for Orzammar to host your order. I am Vartag Gavorn, top advisor to our good Prince Balin. What news do you bring? I don't like Balin. He's an asshole. Yes, the treaty. I've seen he looks it in like the Douglas library. Goldstein. Now the difficulty is that the treaty he only compels rich. our king. Douglas Goldstein is a co-writer on right. Robot Chicken. Oh my. My prince is the rightful king, but a disappointing Speed number robot chicken. of lords... You're like, oh my god, Seth Green's in Mass Effect? <laughs> if you show you <laughs> it took me a second, Balin, but... He might be able to assist with your requests. I don't like Balin, though. He's a meanie, and he killed his brother and framed his other brother. No bastard. I support Haramont. Can I say that? That hurts worst of all. That Haramont... <laughs> Would take advantage take a drink every time you see a character with a beard. Such oh hell no, in Orzmar I'll die of alcohol poison. <laughs> <laughs> the women have beards too, just not on their faces. <laughs> oh. However reputable that stranger did, might be. Did the joke go over Pico's head? I, if it's a reference to the game, then yes. <laughs> Everybody in the comments Wait, for Pico. We must be cautious well, about whom to trust. Whatever. But perhaps we could find. I, I'm pretty sure I know what you mean. Haramont is just... engaged in a campaign of bribery and coercion to ensure that every house serves him. But if a neutral party, he's a lying, Pico, were to approach certain key members, Objection. perhaps with irrefutable evidence of Haramont's deception, he totally I'm certain legit, my right? Lord Prince would show his gratitude. Especially when his eyes went derpy at the end of that scene. Uh, what kind? Evidence. Well, I'm not doing your dirty work. Screw you. My prince to see you as anything more than uh oh, he's got a scowl look. I will be here if you change your mind. <clears throat> and I'll just see you as a oompa loompa and laugh at you while I walk by. <laughs> the assembly is Can I go? All right. Yeah, yeah, I can go in the assembly. Let's, let's listen to politics. We go. Oh God, it's Star Wars Episode One. Half our houses would go broke without the surface trade. 
The proposal is only effective until we have a king to ensure we are respected by the surfacers. You, you're the king. you conveniently <laughs> positioned to take over all contracts. I'll see your head on a pike first. Decious oh, laws. dude, harsh. The assembly. I've already doubled the guard to prevent <laughs> violence. Must I summon more? Gods! Balin's sympathizers are tying our hands with trivialities. They may as well open us to the sky. I Sounds erotic. With the matter to a vote. Face. I suggest you have a taste of my family's mace. Enough. Whoa! <laughs> Threatening Sadie. Is in oh, no. <laughs> until the members can regain control of their emotions. He should have yelled silence in an yeah. automatic voice like every villain does. <laughs> For free. <laughs> no, he's not a bad guy. <laughs> Oh, Let's talk to Assembly Master. Fools and dusters. I'm sorry. Racism. This is the Assembly of the Clan. The Deuce's Only hair, but with his beard. Oh, I am Herbosius, King of the Seven Seas. <laughs> Forgive me. I am so exhausted. I completely forgot about the message from the gate Who card. Who braids their beards? Welcome to Wars of our Wars. Dwarves. I, I guess, but multiple times. How it, like, think about it. How big us. must his beard really Respect be to braid it that much? But you Ten thousand. Proper <laughs> until we have a king on the oh. Throne. Oh, they need a king on the throne, but a blight's it's coming. coming. But it will still seem distant compared to the empty throne. The assembly oh. is blind to all else. Does what? the city not care the world is about to end? I must admit, Warden, oh. I am at a loss myself. No. It lies with Prince Balin or Lord Harrowmont. They are I like Harrowmont. Lord Paramount? What? No, Harrowmont. <laughs> <laughs> I've got the volume a bit low. It's kind of hard to hear. <laughs> be found at the Harrowmont estate. I turned up the game. The volume on this game is loud. That assembly. guy standing back there is just listening in. I could do for you. He's just standing there like like a stone. It's kind of creepy, actually. <laughs> All right, let us get out of here and back into the diamond quarters. I think that's where we're at. Yes. Wait. Are we in the diamond quarters or are we in the commons? Looks like we're in the. States. I don't remember. Oh hi. I heard there was a gray warden here. I am Ooh. Doolin Forender. Good graphics. Second to Lord Harrowmont. Yes. King Endrin's own choice as successor. Word is spreading that the surface may suffer a blight. It is shameful we are not in a better position to help. Well, you I'm better. I'm busy right now. That may be. <laughs> And that is a terrible risk for the surface. Actually, I want—I want to—I want this guy's help. Tomorrow, Lord Harrowmont cannot <laughs> ignore Balin today. He cannot he's a afford Haramont. to trust yeah. anyone of mm. unproven loyalties. So, how do I get his loyalty? That's a generous offer. If you mean it, you might have uh, to prove Give him it. twenty bucks. The Deshers take <laughs> very bribing will work. Darn. And unfortunately, Balin found some way to blackmail or intimidate House Harrowmont's best fighters into stepping down. Uh oh. So you want me to go get him? Certainly make I just keep thinking, hearing Harem out and thinking it's like a movie Balin studio for a harem. <laughs> no. No fear of meeting with you then. I don't think. Well, we don't get to see Lord Haramont. I don't think we will. No. Excellent. The arena is located off the. Commons. Okay. They want us to go to the proving. Okay. Go to the arena, but save your maximum tomatoes. Obviously. You can look for them in the fighters' preparation chambers behind. His eyes. And be sure it's before the fight oh, again. They stare. The bout, I no see you. The if you need to find me again, Jump cut. I will wait in the Tapster's Tavern off the Commons. Tapster's there Tavern. Is no better place to hear gossip. Perhaps I was just at Tapster's. Jeez, <clears throat> I just drank there. You're all alcoholics here, every single one of you. New quest, Pico. Oh, well, no. they have red hair. Of course, they're alcoholics. <laughs> you r racist, hating on genders. How I'm dare you? My brother has red hair, he doesn't drink. What? Of course they don't. What are you talking about? Oh yeah, there's a si there's some more side quest stuff we can do in here, yeah, Pico. Look at all them. Look at all this exclamation marks. Thief! 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 I'm outraged. A thief His beard. I know, I just can't get over that. Stop braiding. Those are really big braids, too. How big are their beards? <laughs> Pico rants for five minutes. I'm sorry, I cannot get immersed in this game when their beards are defying logic. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> well, you know, we got... Well, I saved the mages and I saved the elves, and I gotta help the dwarves. <laughs> dwarves, All right, I gotta, elves, gotta same thing. Busy. Yeah, I gotta... No, they're not. I gotta go get that... That, uh, some I stole from them. Excuse me, I can't hmm. chat. Well, I so, don't so what kind of elves are do, are in this game? Are they the tiny ones, or are they, uh... Santa elves? Were you looking for a volume? 
Not that I They're like really Link help. elves then. I don't know the libraries very well. With skinnier and longer some faces. Mm. And they have to have bows, for right? About the Orton Tig. Some of he them. Was lost during the last flight, and there aren't. Because they're Dalish elves, and then they're city elves. They were a noble house once, city descended elves. from the Paragon Orton, who composed the Grand Epic of the Seven Brothers in the Orton Symphony. My mother's <laughs> family believes they were descended from Kalana Orton. Does she look better, Pico? When the Tig fell, they all look a bit weird. Named for the house Orta. Well, you just race this against Oompa Loompas. Many records would be buried in the Tig's ruins, somewhere in the deep roads. She might also want to get some clothes that are fit her. <laughs> Well, we gotta go to the deep roads for her, too. The There's a lot to do in the deep roads, oh god. And Lord Haramont have both been sending out in fact, I said that could do some of the yes, deep roads with me. Mm. Any records, that could do it. She that could neck prove armor. I'm a noble. If you could, I'm a noble. now that you're looking. Bullshit. It's almost too much to hope. Well, she originally, her family was, but their records have been lost forever, so I'll go to the deep roads and find proof that she is. Could you read any of the books there? Endrin was king and Orzammar was... I can read the codexes, the but I get... Often speak no. of the swiftness with which I mean, in the left, no, so. But it is different to see it firsthand. Alright, there's a quest I, I gotta ask this guy for. I'm trying to help get a chantry here for this one guy to spread I his religion both. around. Do you have to pick the right dialogue trees to get the crests? Uh, the no, the, it'll get to you sometimes, but you can refuse quests, too. We have to... preserved in Lyrium all of the records of Dwarven history. The memories recorded Dwarven all. crap. Dwarven they history, that'd be an interesting book. how we family a child owes life. How we oh. trace lost tigers. They ensure we forget nothing of our past, good or bad. Hmm, sounds interesting. That yeah. is open a modern quest. Right. Especially for one so new to our city. Well, do it. I said so. What are you going to say to me? Now I see why they're staring at you all the time. I they're confused so. by your glowing this glittering. This is the first time he made this plea. My answer to Brother Burkle hasn't changed. So I ask you the same. On what basis would you have me insult the ancestors and overturn 2,000 years of tradition? Because they're dicks. Oh, come on, let, let, let's do cunning. Please, the charities, man. The what charities. What charities do you mean? You know, we can help the sick and the castless. Come on, and the children and the babies. And the babies, my kids, baby, my kids. I support the charity of buying Pico a new uh, Game Boy Micro. <laughs> Very well. He may hold a prayer meeting as he requested. If not, go to the temple to his god. At least the words would come from one of our own. Now, is there anything more? Can I we continue out or some our sister? Once, outnumbering even humans and elves. We traded with you to Winter Imperium. And our land stretched as far in the deep roads as theirs did above. Oh, Cal Shirok was capital then. But we lost too many battles. We lost our golems. <laughs> and we lost our territory. Golem. Now the Empire Golem. is simply ruined tunnels filled with darkspawn. Well, you guys shouldn't have sucked so bad in your battles against the darkspawn. <laughs> so do now the elves the have to trade their uh, there, creatures around to get golems? Order. <laughs> These are dwarves. The deep roads uh, and no, uh, they... they anymore because they, they lost the technology to do that they lost the mystic link cable <clears throat> yeah the no no no, no. <laughs> in fact <laughs> in fact the paragon bronca is in the deep roads looking the for an anvil that makes gold for years, it can make they were weapon against the dark <laughs> that sounds like an animaniacs plot the magic anvil it's the called the anvil of the void but we'll get to that eventually when it fell we lost his secret to creating golems there are books about it along these walls if you see he said we lost the secrets to getting golems hey what about my golem we have only a few dozen left in Orzammar, and I do not recognize this one. Where is he? Need to find it. Let's golem will talk. Every golem is precious to us. He's called He's Shale. A good sum for a new find. Huh? Oh my God, who's that? Into a pit of lava. One of my companions. <laughs> was there anything else? <laughs> that was awesome. It's like I must who the tell fuck the rest of the secret about this discovery. <clears throat> At Where the other is side of the old Empire. During the last blight, that guy's the like kings a... of Orzammar knew they couldn't mm -hmm. hold everything. They sealed the He's deep got a roads, mustache. abandoning everyone still trapped yeah, in the Yeah, it looks cardboard. It was the only it's way to fake. survive. It's fake. Yeah, it's <laughs> they just the take that stupid thing off and it off. We only rediscovered them recently, and they still it's haven't Danny forgiven Danny DeVito! <laughs> How'd you lose your golems? Oh, no, I think I already asked that. Uh... Do you mind if I can, Warden? Okay, uh, let's... All what's the difference between ancestor and a paragon? The stone as ancestors, to guide their families forever. But only one every few generations rises to Paragon. A Paragon is a dwarf whose accomplishments change Orzammar so much that the assembly recognizes they've been born blessed. 
they are venerated as living ancestors <laughs> and found a new noble house forever bearing their name. Sounds erotic. So Bronco was in Paragon. Paragon. Now and in I've run out of stuff to point out in the background. <laughs> but her inventions caught the <laughs> Before she had seen 20 years, she created a smokeless coal. It could burn in a Let's cave go. without vents and no one would choke from it. Oh, it wow. her paragon status. So where she is She went Bronca? into the deep roads two years ago seeking out secrets of the ancient smiths. She never returned. Oh, no. Wait. She stayed According there to, to live legends, with them. Seven <laughs> founded our empire. Yeah, with the, the dark swan, let me tell you. Was the <laughs> They're really nice guys when you learn to... His like children when you, formed the noble yeah, cast. When you get around yeah, the yeah, with them the killing ocean. everybody and all that. Yeah, I mean they kill king. people, but <laughs> damn, they make good they make good sandwiches. Shotgar founded the artisans. Ah, actually the taint. We had to drink artisans. their blood to become a gray warden. It was Orzammar mm. who dug the mine <laughs> Some of the city's foundation. And one guy that drank the blood died. I did. And knocked. Well, Both that's what you get for drinking a blood type that doesn't match yours. All we had to become gray wardens. He swore to serve his brother's sons. Because the blood inside of us is called the taint, and we use it to sense <laughs> dark. By their own yes, laugh, Pico. Sorry. Laugh. <laughs> they have no ancestors to guide them, and no families to claim them. They should Pico's not have just thinking born. of naked misty. Their parents defied their shame and brought cursed children into the world. When am I cursed. not? It's better they die young. <laughs> Thursdays. Wow, he just Our so oh well. Kept us through four blights His belief is stupid. Games. Consider that I wish that was an option for the dialogue. You're stupid. I did. I says I can't talk to someone who believes that. It would have been. It would have been oh, sorry. <laughs> hey, that's a good group shot. Yeah. Woo! Look at my companion, Pico. That, right, that that's the Christmas card there. <laughs> I got a see witch lady, a whore rogue, and a giant golem with me right now. My companions are actually really cool. <clears throat> that, that guy you just walked by should have dropped dead because you're leaving poison behind you. <laughs> Well, my, as long as my sword doesn't touch him. This is called the Blight Blood. You get it from doing this DLC mission that's I haven't shown yet in this game, but I will eventually. Oh, you Lord DLC, you cheater. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Mm -mm. Well, it gives it to you if you do the mission and you start a new profile, and then it automatically has it in your inventory, so I might as well use it. Hmm. Yes, he is. Uh-oh, we got a, a conversation. Ah, uh, goodbye. <laughs> Sodding ancestors. Sodding How can you people just ignore that? What do you mean, Bronca you people? Didn't go alone, Abra. She took the whole house. Everybody but you. So just uh -oh. get over to Tapsters. And I want to hear Mr. Gruff again. You know as well as I do that's how. Uh, Augurn's awesome. Ends. You think I'm afraid of some cub warrior who's barely <laughs> off the teach? <laughs> Yar. <laughs> Or attack a single I'm a pirate. You stripped of your cast and exiled. Even you can't have forgotten that. Get out of here before I call a guardsman. Get, get out! Get out now! Yes, look at him go. Can you believe it? Algren's barely even wore your cast anymore, and he just clomps in here like he's entitled. Whoa, so, uh... Who the fuck are you? Who are you? Yeah. I'm Who are you? Ivo, warrior. <laughs> Who are you and why shouldn't I cut your I head off? For that useless sod. Whoa, who was he? Ogren's a drunken wretch. He comes up here two, three times a week, hounding people to lead oh, some suicidal rescue mission after Bronca. Gets quite violent about it. I'd be scared if they hadn't practically gelded him after he killed young Lord Mino. Whoa, what happened? All that was pretty Sun scary. Said was how unlikely it was that a bunch of smiths would return safely from the deep roads. The end of that it sword true. looks. Ancestors mm. preserve us. <laughs> That's what the warrior cast is for. Yes. <laughs> I wasn't going to say it. Insult to a paragon. Next thing, they're in a duel to first blood to defend Bronco's uh -oh. honor. Then Ogren starts screaming and running. Oh, it's one of those out. useful chest belts. No, that I you take see. you kill them. It was a huge scam. What, like, what's with the chest belt? Why do characters have those? Magic. Because we can't think of something to put on the character design. Add a belt. Well, that sucks for Augurn. <laughs> oh, well. She's still his wife, isn't she? Oh, Augurn was married to Bronca. How do we make our character look original? Add more spikes! <laughs> Damn it, Pico, why you don't pay attention? I'm listening, kind of. Augurn was one of the 
best warriors of his generation. I see. So, uh, Bronco going the deep roads? She was quite secretive. Outright rude, really. He said she a never bitch. asked about oh, the <laughs> that she didn't care about politics, and that we were too self-absorbed to Sorry. defeat the Darkspawn. She uh -oh. actually threatened anyone who said they'd come after her. Oh, I'm gonna go after get going now. She oh. a smokeless fuel that let the Smith cast increase their output by nearly a third. Deaths Whoa. from the Black Cloud their output, also eh? Hoop, hoop, hoop. The assembly said she had the favor Too of bad Bronca's crazy. ...and declared her a paragon. They moved Bronca, be a Ogren, and all their relatives to the noble be a paradigm. ...and founded a new house in a her name. I want to be a parallelogram. Yeah. It's been two years since Bronca... I want to be a part Donnie Moi. No one has ever stayed <laughs> yeah. in deep roads that long. She's been gone for two years, Pico. Search you think she's alive? Probably. Ogryn wants to two years the in the deep roads? I mean, jeez. All you need is a tent and a can of beans. That'll last you. Silence, <laughs> so you Canadian. Tell him was added again. <laughs> well, guys, I think that's it for this episode. Because, yeah, I've been recording for a while. And say bye, Pico. Say bye, bye, Pico. Bye, bye, Pico. <laughs> By the way, Puico is a misspelling of Pico, because W is right next to E on the keyboard. Derp derp. Yay. <laughs> that was fun. Too bad that was the only part I had.